In this video, I will share how to get meaningful insights from HeatMap. HeatMap is a great tool for visualizing complex static data, but how to interpret and unlock the real insight behind the data? Continue watching this video to learn about it. Let's start with what people are clicking on. When you view the page from your heat map software, do you notice the user are focused on the wrong part? Oftentimes, we thought the website design direct the user to the intended session, but they shift their attention to somewhere else. Besides, you might notice the user click the non-clickable element, usually it's the text or even decorative graphic. This data gives you a strong feedback about the website design. If the page has strong images that attract attention, you'll be surprised how many try to click an unlinked image. Not to forget the pricing table features or comparison chart are some of the must-have analyzed heat maps. When you just change a new pricing structure or new package, the click data from the heat map provide valuable insight. This can show the product or services really fulfill the needs of the customer or not. Since the Mobile Garden and Google Call Web Vitals announced by Google, the Mobile UX is playing an important role for Google search ranking. First, by filtering the desktop view and mobile view of the data, you are able to clearly identify the user behavior is different. The web designers might give more priority on the desktop version for the website, but ignoring the mobile version. Heatmap's data are able to show the user behavior, especially for the mobile users. This is the time you might need to adjust the space, font size, or design element to increase the mobile user experience. Another critical aspect of mobile UX mistakes is the navigation menu. While the drop down is looking fine for desktop, but the mobile experience is a different story. This is a time to decide to shift the position or completely redesign the menu to give what the user wants. Furthermore, it's the scroll maps data. If you spend your budget on paid ads using a landing page, the scroll map can show the effectiveness of the page. Start by reviewing the position of the above the fold and confirm whether people are accessing all the important information on the section. This is the moment you might need to use the real data to improve your website design. Also, look for sharp changes in color. This portion will indicate that user most likely will skip the session by scrolling or jump to the next button area. Using scroll map information, you will have enough data to determine whether key information is getting ignored by the manager of your user and needs moving to a more visible place. Okay, that's all about how to get meaningful insights from heat maps. Remember about this, marketing without data is like driving with your eye closed. Thanks for watching, make sure to subscribe and don't miss out my future video. Remember to like, comment and share this video.